Hey everybody and welcome back to our channel, your go-to place for smart and simple software tutorials. In today's video, we are diving into Utrack, a powerful project management tool by JetBrains that helps teams plan, track, and manage their work more efficiently. Whether you're a project manager, developer, or part of a growing team looking for better task tracking and agile workflows, Utrack has something for you. So by the end of this tutorial, you'll know how to navigate Utrack like a pro and boost your team's productivity. So make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you never miss a tech tip from our channel. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do, visit the official website of JetBrains U-Track. As you can see, you have the option to get started for free, absolutely at no cost. Just provide all the information needed. And then what will happen is, now once you have successfully created your account here in U-Track, you will be forwarded to the main homepage. You have like a small dialog box welcoming you to the platform. Of course, you have three options. You can explore the demo project, delete the demo, and start a new project, which is we're going to do that for now. Let's start a new project because that would forward us to the main homepage. All right. Now, before we create our new project, I, want you, I wanted you to um, see all the tools that we can use for the Utrax tools on the left side. Now, we have now very quickly, I'm going to discuss the issues. All right. So this is going to be at the core of you track wherein you can view all the tasks bugs user stories and requests are listed okay if you want to add a new is issue all i have to do is click the activate button all right now let's say in this instance i'm going to be adding this you can paste it here matter of fact you can you see that there's going to be an image here, right? So let's add an image in our issue. And then I want you to click the create. So we have successfully created our first issue here in Utrack. Now, the idea is that you can track and manage all the individual work items. You have the demo and of course we have created our first issue. You can add custom fields if you want or for example, you can assign it to a teammate and tracks of the progress. The dashboard is essentially where you can provide a customizable view of project data and activity. Okay, so you have like widgets for burn down charts. If you want to add a widget, it's okay. So for example, you can choose from report, project team, access eraser, issue lists, or for example, um, work item explorer. I want you to click on it and you will be forwarded to a new page so that you can add a specific widget so you can track progress and team workload at a glance the agile boards are going to be the kanban or scrum style boards for visual task management at this point you can add a new card here if you want and click that you can create swim lanes columns for workflow states because a scrum team manages their sprint backlog and tracks the current sprint obviously the report section provides insights and analytics about your issues and team performance which is really helpful if you are in a collaborative environment with your team members other freelancers or even your client there is a drop down menu on the on the top right corner you can create issue per assignee until Gantt chart. Of course, you can click the create a report. Now, these are going to be some of the samples or templates that you can generate so that you don't have to create reports from scratch. If you click the issues per assignee or some examples, you can do that. Let's say this goes here. All right. Now, with this in mind, team leads evaluate sprint performance or time spent per user or project okay and then of course the project is earlier that we have and we we can create a project from here you can choose to have a project from any of the following a scrum kanban demo 
in this case we're going to be creating a kanban project template i want to use this template and now i'm gonna i'm gonna add an image here and then obviously click the create a project you can add people to your new project for example if you're working with their client team members or other freelancers you can do them here but for now we're gonna skip setup and go to the project itself and as you can see you can we have already successfully created our new project okay the knowledge base is essentially a built-in wikileak system to document project information for example if you wanted to document the guides or faqs for team onboarding this is going to be the centralized place for documentation and information sharing if you want to add a new guide for example a new article you can do that click project and click it here you can have a markdown editor page hierarchy linking to issues or other articles now a support team maintains troubleshooting guides for recurring issues and of course the time sheets is where you can track how much time team members spend on various tasks you see that there is a blue button here that says add spend time if you want to do that you can put it here and describe the time sheets now these are going to be the weekly timesheet entries approval workflow time tracking per issue a consultant right here can log hours per client project for invoicing click on save and now the next is going to be the gantt chart the gantt chart is a visual representation of project timelines and dependencies of course if you click the get started you can plan and track tasks timelines and dependencies if you click the uh, project of course we're going to use this if you hover to the uh, advanced settings we can create that and now a project manager can set deadlines and dependencies to avoid delays all right now the create button is again will forward you to the new issue and new article all the while the administration gives you all the settings if you wanted to customize the role permission access level to other members here within your u track platform all right and then if you feel that u track from JetBrain is going to be on the platform for your organization you might want to consider going to the administration you have the time tracking and integrations of course you can go to the imports mailbox build server zendesk and JetBrains ai and with that being said that's a wrap on our walkthrough of utrack so if you're looking for a flexible developer friendly and highly customizable project management tool utrack is definitely worth checking out it's perfect for tech teams agile squads and anyone who values detailed tracking and automation but if you're new to project management tools the learning curve might feel a bit steep at first but once you get the hang of it it's incredibly powerful if you found this video helpful do not forget to subscribe to our channel hit that bell icon so you never miss out to any of our deeper dive into any u track features that you wanted for us to discuss if you have any questions drop them in the comments below we'd love to hear from you thank you so much for watching and we will see you again in the next one